Nutrition and Diet At our nutrition and diet dispensary, we aim to raise awareness of healthy nutrition, increase people's quality of life and support treatments for diseases thanks to the plans in place. Our nutrition and diet clinic, which prepares personalized diet and nutrition programs, examines in detail the condition of all outpatients and inpatients and supports the nutrition program with foods that will speed up people's recovery process. In our nutrition and diet clinic, besides preparing a balanced and adequate personalized nutrition program, we also prepare nutrition and diet programs that will enable people to reach their ideal weight using body composition measurement technology. Our experts use body composition measurement technology to control metabolic age, body muscle, fat and water ratios, basal metabolic rate and the lubricating state of the organ environment. Our specialists, who carefully complete all control and body analyzes, take into account the health status of people and develop nutrition and diet programs accordingly. In our Department of Nutrition and Diet, Eating Disorders, Cancer, Sports Nutrition, Osteoporosis, Diabetes, Gastrointestinal Diseases, Hypertension, Cardiovascular Diseases, Kidney Diseases, Parenteral Nutrition, PCOS, Obesity and Metabolic Surgery, Aging, Menopause, Pregnancy, Lactation, Childhood, Adolescence, Enteral Nutrition, Personal Training and Regular Nutrition follow-up are provided. Nutrition and Diet in Childhood it is very important that children, who are the basic building blocks of society and exhibit regular growth and development, are fed in a balanced, healthy and adequate manner. Because nutrition is an activity that continues for the sake of continued growth and development, the continuation of life, and the protection of health. School-aged children are the groups most affected by childhood undernutrition between the ages of 6 and 12. In addition, malnutrition habits acquired especially in childhood increase the risk of developing diseases such as obesity, high blood pressure, cholesterol and cardiovascular disease when children become adults. For this reason, the correct and balanced food habits acquired in childhood will ensure that children live a good life and exhibit healthy development. Our nutrition and diet department aims to ensure that children acquire healthy eating habits through proper and balanced nutrition programs and the provision of necessary training. The eating habits of children between the ages of 6 and 12 are directly influenced by family, environmental and individual factors. For this reason, while preparing personalized healthy nutrition and diet programs, it instructs them to show necessary care in their family and to avoid behaviors that will negatively affect their children. Nutrition and diet during pregnancy Thanks to the placenta, all the nutrients that expectant mothers eat during pregnancy are transferred to the baby and the baby grows in this way. For this reason, nutrition programs for expectant mothers during pregnancy are planned to meet the needs of the child. Thanks to these planned programs, the process of healthy development of the child is supported with the help of the mother. The implementation of the nutrition and diet program during pregnancy not only supports the healthy growth and development of the child but also prevents the expectant mother from gaining excess weight during pregnancy. Nutrition and diet for the elderly Today, the increase in the elderly population compared to previous periods confirms that the individuals included in this group should pay as much attention to their nutrition as the individuals in the children's group. In our nutrition and dietetics outpatient clinic, an adequate and balanced nutrition program is prepared by taking into account the physiological and metabolic changes that occur in the elderly. Nutrition and diet for polycystic ovary syndrome Polycystic ovary syndrome, a metabolic disorder with a genetic component, especially in women of childbearing age, also causes various complications in people. People with polycystic ovary syndrome are more likely to develop obesity or insulin resistance. For this reason, people who are faced with such problems should pay great attention to their diet. Because polycystic ovary syndrome is not seen as a disease but as a problem that can be overcome by following a balanced and adequate diet. In the outpatient nutrition and diet clinic, the necessary examinations are carried out for people with PCOS and nutrition programs are created taking into account individual differences. Obesity 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 is a disease that occurs because the amount of energy taken in does not equal the amount of energy expended. Many problems such as wrong, irregular and unbalanced nutrition, consumption of prepared foods, skipping meals and eating too much led to weight gain in people. Obesity that causes various and permanent problems is a condition that needs to be treated. 
the problem of obesity, which negatively affects almost all body systems, increases the risk of many diseases such as cancer, blood pressure, menstrual disorders, cholesterol, diabetes, infertility, heart diseases, respiratory diseases, and bone and joint disorders. Our nutrition and nutrition department, which aims to raise the quality of life by creating awareness of healthy nutrition in the community and supporting the treatment of diseases, provides nutritional services to support the healing process through nutritional therapy programming for inpatient and outpatient services. In our diet dispensary, basal metabolic rate, metabolic age, organ obesity, body fat and muscle, and water percentages are measured using the body composition measurement technique. After measurement for customers, a fully customized nutrition program and nutrition education are provided.